okay guys um come with me let me show you what i feed my snow it's actually a, a beginner level experience that i'm doing so this is just a small pen that i i constructed just nearby my construction uh sites i'm supervising and also taking advantage of uh the environment because when i walk through this uh banana i i go around here and i can pick them can pick the snails from this environment so i pick a few of them and i also bought some in addition so in in in, in total i have about uh 20 20 so I'm just showing you to motivate you. You can do snail business irrespective of your shadow. I I am into construction professionally, but then I picked interest in snail farming after watching a lot of videos on YouTube and I want to show you. So this is what I feed my uh, snails. I, sh I feed them with um, Cocoyam leaves, as you can see, they've eaten it. I feed them with oranges, as you can see, these are ripe oranges. Okay, if you give them the unripe oranges, they might not eat them. I also feed them with the tomato. Down here, I also have uh, this is purple leaf, purple leaf. I do also feed them with the purple fruits, the ripe one. Considering the nature of the snail, giving them the ripe uh, fruits is best for them. But when the substance is harder, they find it difficult to consume. Uh, so, now let me tell you um, what motivated me to go into uh to to make an attempt at this snail business um considering you have say i'm speaking from ghana so considering you have say a hundred cities and the in my case i didn't have to invest any money into this structure because i picked the woods from from my site and i built this structure and uh, as they grow then i would invest in a, a more permanent uh, structure for them let's say you have a hundred cities you buy any number of snail that your hundred city can buy scientifically they as they they can lay about uh, almost a thousand that is what information i gathered from the scientific uh, perspective but our experienced uh, farmers have also indicated they can lay between 400 500 that is all these figures are annual figures okay so let's even assume that due to poor handling uh, you are not able to uh, get maximum egg laying and you are able to get around 200 x annually guys i think this is huge what it means is that your 100 cities would have multiplied itself 200 times think about it snow farming is 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 something else i believe everybody can do it and the financial incentives aside the fact that you see when you see these guys growing it brings some joy see see one cool guy hiding right here and another one two hiding right here another one hiding two of them actually actually three of them see hiding right there so Consider, consider that how your hundred city
can multiply itself 200 times 200 times in one year that is given the circumstances that they are able to produce at least 200 eggs and they do produce more than that the scientists say they can produce up to a thousand but then I am using 200 for for this uh, analysis let's so let's say you got 200 X per year I don't think any business will give you that yield that kind of yield in one year in one year guys snail business is profitable snail farming business is profitable and please if you have a small backyard try try something small as this uh, get a carpenter to do it nicely for you unlike mine that i built it on the construction sites okay so just try it with a few let it be there for and with the with this feed yes you would have to be complete um uh to complementing the feed with formulated ones but those ones uh, let's say once or twice a week is when you'll be needing it but these ones all of these feeds i get them from this environment and i drop them inside okay so i'm not spending any money at least for now on feeding just my time that's what i invest and i always come to see them at evening and drop the feet inside you can you can you can make an attempt so don't let this opportunity waste all around africa food security is is a major issue so we are trying to encourage ourselves to bring up with uh, to come up with ideas for ourselves ideas made by ourselves for ourselves let's join the train and to make the snail farming business grow thank you